Well, good to have you join us here in Lagos. A federal high court sitting in Ikoyi, Lagos, has sentenced 10 pirates to 12 years imprisonment. This followed their conviction by Justice Ayokunle Faji on a four count charge of conspiracy and hijacking a Chinese fishing vessel on the Gulf of Guinea. I didn't need Taiwo completes the report. Their convicts were arraigned by the Office of the Attorney General of the Federation before Justice Ayokunle Faji in May 2020 on a four-count charge of conspiracy and piracy following an attack on a Chinese fishing vessel FV Hailung Feng in Abidjan, Cote d'Ivoire and their subsequent arrest by the Nigerian Navy. In a landmark judgment that lasted more than two hours, Justice Faji noted that the prosecution team proved the case of piracy beyond all reasonable doubt and established with material fact that the convict boarded the fishing vessel with arms and the intention to forcefully take over the ship. Justice Faji, who described the convict as enemies of humanity, also frowned at the dent their crime has brought on Nigeria's image in the international community. He therefore sentenced each of the convicts to 12 years imprisonment per account, with the sentence expected to run concurrently. They are also expected to pay a cumulative sum of 1 million naira each. Lead Prosecution Counsel Labaran Magaji notes that the judgment is a signal to the world that the federal government is determined about its role in the Gulf of Guinea. This is kudos to our laws and to also show that our institutions, both the arresting investigating and adjudicating agencies are very strong and frown at anybody who is out to sabotage the economy of this country. We are taking the judgment immediately. We want to study it and then we are definitely climbing upstairs. We are, we, we are going to challenge the judgment and of course there are some areas that we are not comfortable with. This is the first time that the new anti-piracy law is being applied in a piracy case in Nigeria and the success is a clear warning to criminals working against maritime security along Nigeria's territorial waters and the Gulf of Guinea. In Lagos, Adini Itaewo, NTN News. Persons with disabilities